Construction workers changed signs in front of Bush Intercontinental Airport's parking garages in Terminal D and E to demolish and rebuild new, more innovative ones. Public Information Officer Augusto Bernat explained. This is a very ambitious program that really is going to re revitalize our international terminal at Bush Airport, and it's going to be more modern, more capacity, and better to, and I should say, it, it's going to provide a better experience for all travelers. The Houston airport system is giving drivers a two-week grace period to get their vehicles out of both parking garages. So right now, people can't park at the ED terminal garage. We have two weeks of grace period for people that might have left their cars over there to remove them uh, so we can start the demolition process. In the meantime, passengers can be dropped off or picked up at both terminals as they will remain open. Bernal added the project has a rather large budget. This project is estimated to cost around $1.3 billion. The demolition and rebuild will be completed by year 2024 or 25. Mariano Yangurin, HTV News.